in that sense that it has um, shimmers and then it's got matte colors. Now, immediately, this right here is going to have to get glued down. Um, I can already tell that they're not glued in there well. It's not magnetic either, so you might have a problem with the little things popping out, but you know, five dollars, hmm, whatever. I'm not going to make a big fuss over it. But, um, the one thing I want to emphasize is the fact that the quality was not what I was expecting. Um, oh, and also, uh, be careful up here. I have seen videos where they that where these little hinges did break, so the whole compact thing was just out the window. But anyway, the quality of Elf shadows for me, Elf always exemplified a good quality, not wonderful but for a dollar for most of their products 
it, it was pretty good. Um, so I was expecting to see this palette. And the one color that I really wanted to try out, well, the two colors, was the green, this green, and this blue. So, immediately after I got my package, opened it up, got to swipe it. So, let me just show you exactly why I was upset with this palette. Okay? One color I waited for, right? And that's what you get. Let me put it on my finger, on my hand. This is what you get. Um, let me go a little deeper. That's what you get. That's the pigmentation of the color. And I was like, is this a joke? Um, are you really being serious right now? So I started swatching other colors, hoping to find something a little better. So me automatically gonna go to the darkest color, which is the black. So let's do black. It's like, are you, are you, like, serious right now? Like, for real? Like, that's, that's what you get when you, when you buy this? You know? So I'm, I'm automatically like, okay, I know that's not the pigmentation that is in the quads, which obviously to me proved is of way better value than a lot of the other elf eyeshadows. So I went to my drama palette. And I swatched the black in there one time. And it's still darker than the one in this palette I got. This is the drama, and this is the palette. And this one, mind you, was swiped multiple times. Let me go ahead and do another swipe for that. Now we're gonna go drama. Swipe it one time. Do you like? Do you see that? That's ridiculous. So off the bat, I was already kind of like, "Wow, seriously, I don't like it." <laughs> I'm just gonna be honest. Like, I'm sitting here like, "Okay, it's five dollars." Elf finally has a giant, like, well, I mean, they had their big, big palette, but, you know, in-store, they have a nice size palette, you know, it looks nice, it appears to be really good quality, and I get it, open it, and it's like, this is a joke. And then you go to the shimmery colors, and they're like, this powdery mess, and I'm just, like, not happy with it. <laughs> I was really disappointed in the whole thing like not the whole thing but just in the shadow quality of themselves like it's not really a go for me right now so yeah not usually I, I can usually take stuff but it just I feel like dang like it's not that great then you go to the shimmery silver colors which I was really expecting to show me up and it's still not that great this one is from the um, quad, and this one is from the uh, the palette. Let me show you that from the palette. And then from the quad. Like, obviously they can't be the same manufacturer because that's like a really big difference. So overall, I'll give this product a, I think I'm going to give them an, I'm going to give them an 8 for a presentation. Overall presentation, the presentation was great. Um, I'm going to give them an 8. For the quality of this product, I'm going to give them a 4. I'm gonna give them a four because I do like the color choice. I like that it's neutral with a couple good bright colors, and then you have the smoky colors in there, 
but overall like maybe it'll go up after I use them a little bit but right now first off the bat first impression it's a four it's definitely a four and that's just because I like the palette itself I love the palette I give the palette an eight so do I recommend that you buy this if you already have elf products no I don't recommend that you buy it if you already have elf products if you are a beginner then sure go for it it's only five bucks you get all these colors for five dollars but if you already have elf products if you already have the quads it's not it's not a staple it's not necessary for your makeup collection so that is my view on the products um, so yeah I mean honestly like I might end up just like taking these little things out and just pressing eyeshadows in here like why not <laughs> I love I love the palette <laughs> but anyway that's my review on this uh, product so hope it was helpful for you guys um, so I'll talk to you guys later bye